Good morning. We're going to show a demo today of the Verbos and Associates 291 V. This is a dual bandpass filter in the Buchla format. As you can see, there are two of them. We're going to focus on one of them today just to get an example of the sound. I haven't seen many of these in the wild, so uh, I figured this would be a fun demo to start with. And I'm going to just set everything to maybe like a center point. And we're going to just turn on this sawtooth wave because we got a saw coming into the input. The outputs go into a 292E. Yeah, just some simple, simple fun. And uh, like I said, this is kind of like a easy place to start. Okay, now we're going to take the uh, 281E and we're going to modulate the center frequency. And you'll notice there's a Q adjustment here too. This is like a, a, a nice addition to the filter. And now I'm going to use uh, 245, and we're going to use a step sequencer this time on it. And let's see what it does. So, step sequencer. And last but not least, we'll add a little bit of FM. Mm -hmm. 
Definitely, definitely an interesting circuit, none, none, nonetheless, you know, it's a very, very interesting bandpass filter. It's a lot of range with the Q, you know, this, this modification. And really, you know, I love it because it fits in the mix really nice with like really bassy sounds. So this, this bandpass filter is really nice at center frequency sounds, you know, things that are in the middle, things that are in the high frequency range. It's also very good at focusing on some low frequency. Um, and like I said, I haven't seen many of these. I bought this back on the West Coast online off of someone, I believe, in Seattle. <clears throat> so I got this and the I think it's the 254V at the same time. A very interesting module, nonetheless. Um, yeah, so I thought everybody would be interested in seeing a little demo on this. Thanks for tuning in. Until next time.